OS Today I'm gonna show you my home city Yokohama Yokohama is the second largest city in Japan Unfortunately, it's not a very famous or popular place for tourists However, it's a beautiful city by the ocean and has so many natural and urban charms Recently, they opened cable cars as a form of transportation right in the middle of the city This is the first for Japan and still very rare in the rest of the world In this video, I'll show you some of Yokohama's famous attractions and hopefully you get interested and visit my home city after COVID-19 Are you ready? Let's get started! First, I want to kick it off with Chinatown Yokohama was originally developed and still functioned as a poor city and a lot of Chinese merchants used to come here Today, Yokohama is known for one of the world's biggest Chinatowns I came here with my friend from America, Mario She's living in Japan now and making YouTube videos as well So make sure to check the link in the description to watch her video too When you come to Chinatown, you know what to do Eat Chinese food Yokohama Chinatown has a bunch of Chinese street food So I recommend you stir around and try different things Look at these cute pandemons It's so cute It's so cute I'm sad already <laughs> Yeah Alright, so you wanna eat it? Yeah, I'm feeling really guilty about this Yeah um, mine, mine looks really um, like cheerful And <laughs> Like, I feel, I think that's worse. I'm so sorry. Oh, shit. If you get tired of eating, it might be a good idea to visit Kantebu Shrine in Chinatown. It's dedicated to a famous Chinese general, Kanwu, and has been an anchor for Chinese people living in Japan up to today. Now we're at Yamashita Park, 5 minutes away from Chinatown. This park is alongside Tokyo Bay which is connected to the Pacific Ocean and a lot of families and couples spend time here every day However, it's not like the crazy crowded parks in Tokyo You can have a calm and relaxing time in the sea breeze here mm. We are heading to a new cable car station built in this district a couple of weeks ago it's so rare for a big city like Yokohama to have the cable cars as transportation So we are very excited to check it out Since Yokohama has been one of the biggest ports for over 150 years, there is some historical architecture related to that. This is Yokohama Wet Brick Warehouse, which was built as a warehouse by the Meiji government after they opened the port in Yokohama. Nowadays, the area around the Wet Brick Warehouse is maintained as a Wet Brick Park, which is a popular tourist spot. And a lot of events and festivals are held here every year. In winter, because both times I came here. We found cable cars. I've never seen cable cars going back and forth between these high buildings. It's cool. Let's go buy the ticket and get on.
These cable cars are called Yokohama Air Cabin. They were introduced in April this year and have many new functions for battery, lighting, temperature control, and safety monitoring. From up the cable car, you can look at over all of the places we went today like Chinatown, Yamasa Park, and the Red Brick Warehouse as well as other commercial facilities and amusement park. Hope you enjoyed the video and got interested in my home city. See you soon!